Hi guys, very excited Wombat here today and I'm gonna do something I rarely get to do. I'm gonna do a map review of a new map for ATS and not only that, I'm gonna do a map review of a new standalone map for ATS and that is something I haven't been able to do for at least a year now so I'm really excited about this and uh, yeah, let's dive into the Columbia Real Map ATS for 134. So the um, uh, Columbia Real Map is currently in beta. It requires American Truck Simulator version 1.34, as I said earlier, and it also requires the DLCs Oregon and New Mexico. Currently, it contains 15, sorry, 17 cities, and it's growing rapidly. When I just did my live stream of this just a few days ago, it had 15 cities, now it's 17, so it's growing. And it contains a lot of interesting features. Uh, it has Colombian license plates in traffic, so there's no cheating there. Uh, it also contains uh, uh, Colombian police cars, uh, a lot of Colombian traffic, and you can expand that further by downloading the uh, Colombian traffic, traffic mod uh, and uh, trailers as well and other things. Those, those things, for some funny reason, costs money, where the map then instead is for free. So that is another twist I haven't seen before. Traffic costs money, trailers cost money, but the map is for free. So uh, that's a funny twist, I like that. Uh, it is also a map where you can use a bus if you like. There are cargo included in the map, but there is also a downloadable bus mod for this map that expands that even further. So, um, yeah. The fun thing about downloading this map, by the way, is that you will have to go to the web page, or the, in this case, Facebook page, download three of the four files, and the fourth file you can get or you will get by emailing the creator of the map. Of course, you do that on Facebook, so it's Messenger. Uh, he will send you a link to the fourth file, uh, and off you go. Uh, since this map also is a standalone map, you will need a new profile for this map, if you don't already have one, obviously, for the map uh, from previous betas. Uh, the map uses a new playing module called columbia.mbd. I'm going to show you how to set a profile up and how to uh, then add the maps to it, the map mods to it. Uh, but before we do, let's have a look at this. You know, because I, I did my live stream and said, oh, it would be great doing quads on this thing, doing... Uh, road trains and perhaps even special transport and it's not because there's a new version now turned out that the map already contains a special transport route as well so uh, yeah dream came uh, true and it is as much fun as you can imagine it being on a map like this with all its twisty roads and yeah you just have to try this out for yourself. And fact is, I'm gonna release the entire uh, special transport I'm doing right now as a separate video because I had so much fun doing it. But enough talking, let's head into how you set this map up. And the first thing you need to do is create a new profile. I'm calling myself Wombat Colombian. Add a picture, truck design, a company logo, and that's the wrong truck, uh, Volvo, there we go, and a company name. Now, before you click the create button, you then go to the uh, mod manager, and you'll find four files, or five actually, I'll go through those. You have the base one file, base two file, ATS models, ATS map, and then the um, fix for chromofix as well 
click Confirm Changes, change the playing module to columbia.mbd. Very important step, if you don't do this you will have problems. I also uncheck the Steam Cloud account, click Create, skip Wizard, let the game load for a little bit before you get onto the screen where you get to select your headquarter. And not all cities are available as a headquarter city, but um, and as you can see, uh, the map is getting ready for all the districts of Colombia. Uh, I'm gonna go with the default, click confirm selection, skip the tutorial, and off you go. That's it. You will of course then have to complete your first haul before you're in game, so to speak. Um, but uh, let's go back and have a look at the map and as you can see uh, the background is the country of Colombia with all its different, uh, I don't know, the districts. Um, so the map is ready for all of Colombia. So far we have, as I said earlier, 17 cities and as you hopefully can see on this map, a lot of twisty, twisty roads, which is absolutely fantastic. There are very, very few highways here, and I love that fact. There are possibly someone, some there in the middle. I'm gonna mark them, making it a little bit easier to see. But most of the uh, roads are twisty, really twisty, so that's great. And combining those twisty roads with special transport almost brings tears to my eyes. <laughs> uh, playing ATS, you're not really spoiled with new maps or standalone maps. Uh, there are things on this map that could need some improvements. The roads themselves, fantastic. There are no major bugs uh, or hidden walls or things like that to complain about. The um, terrain surrounding the roads, the uh, terrain near the roads are in most places good looking but the mountains and the surroundings a little bit further away from the road in general doesn't look very good. I'm gonna be honest about that. It's not that I care a lot about that. I just wish that it looked a little bit better when you look at mountains in the background. There are a lot of low-res images used for this map and that is a shame because that is the only problem I see with this map. Uh, it's difficult to give you flyover uh, video of this map and really do anything on this map without noticing the uh, low-res uh, mountains uh, in the background. It's a shame they are there. I hope they get removed. This is after all a uh, beta version so I have good hopes that we will see those removed in the future. In any case this map is very, very good and I like it a lot and I highly recommend you try it out yourself. After all, what, what standalone maps do we have for ATS except for, of course, Dalton Elliott Highway? <laughs> There's not much out there, is there? So um, I hope you're going to enjoy this map as much as I'm enjoying doing special transport hauls right now on it. Uh, of course, there are links to the Facebook page in the video description. I can't link directly to the uh, mods and there is no point in doing that either because the fourth file is only accessible from the Facebook page anyway because you have to contact the map creator to get it. That might change when the map uh, leaves the beta face and go on to be in a 1.0 or something like that but right now you need Facebook to download at least parts of this map anyway and that is what I had to say about this map today and now you'll have to excuse me I'm gonna go back and continue completing my haul special transport haul 
uh, on these twisty, bonkers roads. So, uh, take care, everyone, and I hope to see you again next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>